Welcome to the NatFL channel. If the Miami Dolphins decide to take former Oregon offensive tackle Penny Sewell at number 3 in the 2021 NFL Draft, many fans want them to trade up from pick 18 to target a pass catcher. The popular name being thrown around in that scenario is former Alabama wide receiver, Jalen Waddell. In 2020, Waddell only played six games because of an ankle injury. In those six games, Waddle caught 28 passes for 591 yards and four scores. In his three seasons at Alabama, 34 total games, Waddle caught 106 passes for 1,999 yards and 17 touchdowns. He added two punt return touchdowns and a kickoff return for a touchdown too. Here is a scouting report and breakdown of Jalen Waddle's strengths and potential fit with the Dolphins. Strengths, first note and probably the most important note, oh my god, is he fast. He is weirdly fast, meaning you think he has hit his top speed, and then boom, he somehow finds another gear. I wish they had the NFL combined because I believe he would have a real shot to break the 40-yard dash record. Not only is he fast, but he is also lighting quick in space and in tight areas. He navigates his body through traffic so well, it is like he has super senses while he is running. The slightest lean of his body allows no one to get a hand on him when he is on his way to the end zone. Waddle can line up everywhere. I love players like him who can do it all and put stress on the defense before the play even starts. He can win on the outside and the inside, and I even love moving him in the backfield just to create some more confusion. He is an insane route runner, especially for someone that is so fast. He can gear down and make defenders look silly all over the field. That is a massive plus for a player like Waddle because he can generate his own touches while also having some generated touches game planned for him. Before his injury in 2020, he was averaging an absurd 21.1 yards per reception and caught 285 plus yard scores 87 and 90 yards. He is a big play waiting to happen. Overall impression, as you can see with my NFL comparison, I think Waddle does it all. He is not your usual big play receiver that is great at running straight lines and catching deep balls. Waddle flashes every single time the ball is in his hands and is a touchdown waiting to happen. If he isn't making defenders look silly with his route running, he makes them look stupid with his elite after the catch ability. Even though his college production wasn't elite, I think Waddle will have a very productive NFL career. He is going to be a lot of fun to watch in the NFL. Fit with the Dolphins, I have Waddle as my WR2, behind Smith. I think Smith is the best receiver prospect I have ever scouted, but that is not a knock on Waddle. I think Waddle would be an elite fit in Miami. I watched him catch an RPO in his freshman season, make one move, and take it 94 yards to the house. The Dolphins need a playmaker like Waddle. Miami would be crazy to take him at number 3, but trading up a few spots from 18 would be a solid decision. Or maybe he falls to pick 18? CeeDee Lamb fell to pick 17 last year, so it is not impossible. I believe that Waddle has the traits to be better in the NFL than he was in college. Waddle would be an incredible chess piece for their offense and a weapon that starting quarterback Tua Tungavailoa could count on to make plays.